plank lane lift bridge you can only use it out of rush hour can't use it in rush hour it's a busy road nice marina right next to it stop here and top up with water So moored up last night at Pennington Flash. Really magnificent view across there. It's a massive great recreational park formed because of mining subsidence. Nice spot though, just before you get to Lee. Well, the weather spoons in Lee is in the grand old building, used to be the Grand Theatre and Hippodrome. We've had a busy morning, stopped up at Lee, find the laundrette, which is about a 20 minute walk from the moor in here. Popped into Audi to get some essential supplies, two bottles of wine and a stick of broccoli. And um, now we're on our way and we're just about to join the Bridgewater Canal here at Lee. There's a man on the bridge filming me. What it is to be famous. So the Bridgewater Canal built for uh, transportation of coal. Worsley was the, uh, the hub of that. It's turned out to be a really nice April day. The sun's actually got some warmth to it. So I'm not complaining. This crane and hoist arrangement here on the side, so they can lift that, those massive great um, planks into the canal when they want to drain a section for maintenance, etc. Bridgewater Canal, privately owned waterway. All craft must have a license and insurance. But uh, if you pay your license through the CRT, you can get a, a seven day passage for nothing. You have to book it. We've got seven days to traverse. Lots of new housing in here, here, canal side. Hopefully that won't be for illegal immigrants. It'll be for our indigenous population. That's a lovely house they've built there at this marina. It's all in the style of the um, wharfs as they were originally. It's made a really nice job of that. Sun deck there. That's a relic from our past, massive great building.
side of the canal with modern housing again architecturally built to match the original walls. Brooklyn's Mill then, that is. smoke and grime, which is why so many of the buildings do look black. Back in the day when we were the powerhouse of the world, giving it all the way to China now, again just the sheer scale of them, ginormous. Okay, so we've got some guys fishing down here on the right hand side and a broad beam coming the other way as well. So with their rods sticking out into the water and the broad beam I haven't got enough room to get through. I've slowed right down to a crawl to uh, try and accommodate them but this guy needs to pull his rod in. With a nice vista across the fields. On our camper van. new ones some of them haven't even been moved into yet that wouldn't be bad would it once it's a game of dare there's a boat coming right on the bridge
Indeed. Basically, and well, tried to come through when I was already there, and he hit us. He hit us. Yeah. Stay in there. going through Ashley Green where there's a colliery museum it's the last pit head winding here in the whole of Lancashire interesting story you can just see the top of the uh, winding gear behind those houses Yes, Absolutely. good. It makes a change. Yeah, yeah, jumps. Yes, got to get on with it. Pleasant enough to actually be outside. 
without some howling wind and rain that we've had of late. This bend on the left hand side is a magnificent Mock Tudor building. It was um, part of the original offices, ticket house for the barges, etc. 